Inspection, you guys should probably remember all the inspection things. We look at the gills, see how nice and moist they are. Then we're going to go to the eyes, nice and bulging and clear. If they're, you know, the, the species should have that. Scales, this has all pretty much been descaled. There'll be a few there, but not many. Texture, making sure that it's nice and firm. And then we're going to look inside at the belly, making sure that there's not a lot of protruding bones or anything like that. Okay? So that's how we're going to start that. Now, some chefs will teach you to come down the backbone this way, which I do when I do codfish, and I roll it right off. This one, I'm going to take it one shot, down around the pectoral fin to here. I'm going to take my knife and go right straight along that in one shot. I just want to rinse my hands because I don't like it to be. I don't like albumin on my hand when I'm working with the blade. One other thing, too, that I want you to realize is that every species, you fillet just a little bit differently. So I'm going to open this up here like so, and I'm going to take my knife and I'm just going to let it roll right off the backbone. All right? I'm going to pick this up. People that are standing right there, you're going to watch my knife go right down along that vertebrae. So I'm going to take it. I'm on the side of the vertebrae. Can you see where it is now? All right? And you hear me cutting those bones. That's the pin bones that I'm cutting. Flip that over just like that, okay? So I'm just going to set this here. Now I'm going to take this and I'm going to remove from the belly area these wonderful breast bones. And you notice I have my finger on the blade because I can see and feel everything that's happening. And as I keep coming through this way, all right, I'm gonna get right about to where this bone is, this fin, I mean, and I'm gonna take from the poop chute, and I'm just gonna run my knife straight down through here, just missing that. And I'll put all the trash right there. Now I'm going to come back over this side. I'm just going to lightly get my knife down underneath the skin. And you notice I'm pulling the skin as well as the knife. And we'll pick this up like so. Okay. Now we have that, it looks like this here. Now I'm going to take my tweezers, look at that nice piece of fat. Okay. And I'm going to start right in the head area, and I'm just going to go ahead and pull the pin bones out. This one's giving me a hot time. Chef, does it um, make a difference in the knife that you use? I prefer a slicing knife to do salmon. Some people, like I said, Chef Adele does the roll method, which he starts here and rolls it through. I just take it off in one swipe. And so then I just continue on. And as my hands are going, you notice I'm, I'm taking the bones out this way. I'm pulling them the natural way they would go. So boom, I'll come back and pinch. My fingers and everything are holding that open. So once you get a rhythm going, And mine are angled. If you look at my tweezers, they're angled. Some of them are straight. I don't like my hand up. I'm left-handed and it pulls naturally this way. And once whoever's doing this gets the other side of the salmon, then we'll cut it into portions. And I'll explain to you how uh, we're grilling this today, yes? Okay. And you've got plenty of salsa left from yesterday, or we can make another one so that we've got something to go with it. You could make a nice beurre blanc. We've got some butter. You could do a combination thereof. I could care less. And there you have it. Done.